Hey guys, so today is a get ready with me video and I hope that you guys enjoy it. So let's get right on into it. For my outfit, I'm wearing a mesh t-shirt and shorts from American Eagle since I was going to the all-star game. And for my makeup, I started out with my Neutrogena oil-free moisturizer with SPF 15. I use this every single day and I love it. I decided to just wear concealer, so I'm using my Physician's Formula Conceal RX Concealer. This concealer lasts all day as long as you set it with a powder, so I absolutely love it, and it's from the drugstore, so it's not that expensive. taking my duo fiber brush to just blend that into my skin and I really like this brush because it's soft and it also does a very good job of blending. I'm also using that brush with my Maybelline Fit Me powder. This is in the color 210 I believe or 110. Whichever one is the lighter color, I believe it's 110 actually. And I'm just going to set that underneath my eyes. But for the rest of my face I'm going to use my Remo Matte powder. And I just like this for the rest of my face because I think that it just sets my makeup really well. For my eyes, I'm going to use the NARS eyeshadow primer, and I find that this works very well, especially in the summertime, because it does also help oily eyelids. So I think that it's great for in the summertime when you're sweating and stuff like that to keep your makeup on. For eyes, I just went ahead and applied my Maybelline Color Tattoo in Inked in Pink, and I really love this color. It's such a nice pink metallic color, so I highly recommend that you guys check out the Color Tattoos line. They have amazing colors. For my brow bone, I used my NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil in Milk because I knew this was going to stay on all day long. To set the NYX Jumbo Eyeshadow Pencil and to make it not look as white as it actually was, I just used the matte color from my Vanity Palette from Wet n Wild and I just used that on the fluffy brush just to put that right over top. For eyeshadow, I used MAC Cork and I just put that on an angled brush and just lined my upper lash line. Mascara I used two, and I used the Maybelline Falsies Waterproof Mascara, which I am loving at the moment. And then over top of that, I used CoverGirl's Flash Blast, which is also waterproof, and I love the combination of these two. For blush, I used NYX's Glow, and it stayed on all day long because it is a cream blush, and I absolutely love the color. It can give such a nice blush, but it's a bright blush, so I absolutely am loving this color. For lips, I used my Maybelline Baby Lips, which is in the color Pink Lemonade, and this is SPF, so I wanted to prep my lips before. I used my lip stain, which is by NYC, and it is a 16-hour lip stain in the color Forever Fuchsia. That's all for the makeup, now onto hair. I went ahead and just let my hair dry, so it was basically all the way dry, and then I went ahead and just sprayed in um, Tresemme's heat protectant into my hair, and then just brushed that out to lay my hair was protected. When I used my Conair curling wand, it, this actually isn't a wand, it's a barrel, um, but I believe this is one and a half inches. And I really like just the loose curls that this gives, and I love the look of it in a ponytail, which is what I did. So basically, I took one inch to two inch sections, and I just went ahead and curled them. And I alternated directions the way the curls didn't bunch up all together. And I just did that for my entire head, and then I went ahead and used my scrunch spray, which is from Aussie, and it is a spray that you have to spray from a distance because then it will sort of cause your hair to get crunchy but it did keep my curls all day so I really liked that. It also gives your hair a little bit of texture as well which I really like. So like I said before after I was done curling my hair I went ahead and just put it up into a ponytail and I just did a natural ponytail the normal everyday one that you would do, but I made sure to keep some hair down on the sides just so that it looked a little bit messy but not too unput together. I just 
just went ahead and put on my baseball cap. This is from the Mets uh, merch store that you can get at City Field, and it's an all-star game hat. So, yeah, I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. This is the completed hair and makeup, and I will talk to you guys in my next one. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye. You cut my wings, now I'm falling